New at six, she had a binding estimate from movers for her move back home to Atlanta for just under $5,000. But when it was time to unload her stuff, the movers demanded more than double that. Channel 2 consumer investigator Justin Gray is here. Justin, now after a 10-month-long dispute, they're threatening to auction off her things. And Linda, in this letter warning about that auction, the moving company MMG Movers is now demanding more than $14,000 on top of the $5,000 this Sandy Springs woman already paid all for the contents of a 9 by 10 storage unit. It's just holding it hostage, holding my things hostage. Preschool teacher Angela Forte's Sandy Springs apartment has looked empty like this for not just a few days or even a few weeks. She's been waiting on movers to deliver her things for nearly a year. For me to live like this, I am so ashamed. I am so ashamed. Forte signed this binding estimate for $4,600 with what turned out to be a moving broker who passed the job on to another company. But when the movers from MMG Moving showed up late, the day of the move from California to Atlanta, MMG claims Forte signed this new contract. She had already paid more than $5,300, but MMG says she agreed in writing to pay another $5,700 on top of that. More than $11,000 to move just what you see here, the contents of a 9 by 10 storage unit. They say you signed off on these extra charges. No, I did not. I have a blank. I have a blank thing that I signed because I have to leave. MMG demanded that $5,700 before unloading the truck here in Atlanta. He said, well, you do have a balance and it has to be paid before the things can get off the truck. Now, MMG says it will be auctioning off Forte's things unless she pays up, including thousands more for storage. I can't afford to pay that to anybody. Even if I had the money to pay, I wouldn't pay because they don't deserve that. Right, she should have never signed and agreed to a price that she's not willing to pay. I talked on the phone to an MMG manager who says Forte signed the new paperwork, so owes the money, period. But she is adamant that balance due line for $5,700 was filled in after she signed. When I signed, when I, I put my information here, there was nothing on it. So you're calling her a liar? hundred percent, sir. We have everything to prove that, she, that that's not the way it went. MMG Moving has just a one out of five star rating with the Better Business Bureau. Doing your homework will save you thousands of dollars and a lot of aggravation as well. Lori Silverman from the Team Clark Consumer Action Center says to avoid this kind of mess, customers need to research companies thoroughly beforehand using the Federal Motor Carrier Safety Administration website. And Silverman says never, ever sign a document with blanks on it. You've got to read everything in a moving document and the fine print. I don't know how they go to bed at night and sleep. Now, we called around to other moving companies today and got estimates in the three dollars to $5,000 range for this move. Nowhere close to $11,000. Federal regulators, they have a whole list of red flags to watch out for when you're looking for a moving company. We have a link to that information at WSBTV.com, Linda.